Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy that I finally get to see you and you get to see me, although not technically, I know. But anyway, it's been so long since I've actually sat in front of a camera and filmed like this that I've practically forgotten how to do it. And this is the 10th time that I'm filming this, so I hope it goes okay. And hello, welcome back. I hope all the festivities are all over and you are back to your mundane life. I am back also with a review because I finally saw this product launch in the Indian market and I've had this for a really long time, but I never really got to talk about it or show you guys because this had not launched in India yet. I'm talking about the NYX powder puff lippy these finally launched in india a few weeks ago and i'm so happy because this is such a great product if you want to know why i like this product so much and you want to see uh, know more about the product then please keep on watching let's get into the review so i actually changed my lighting in case you couldn't tell but let's talk about the product which is the nyx powder puff lippy and as you can see i do not have the outer packaging because i've had this for a really long time i've had this for five to six months ever since um my last us haul because i actually got this from the us and um i always thought that i would review this as soon as it launches in india um somehow i threw away the outer packaging but i will insert it on the screen so you can see what the outer packaging looks like and i always thought that um as soon as it launches in india i would get another shade so i get to review two shades for you guys but all the shades in nayaka are sold out within a week of its launch so there is no way that i can get another shade um so i just thought i would just review the shade that i do have which is called cool intentions and this as you can see is a mid-tone brownish nude it looks really um colorful the packaging they are all color coded so no matter how many shades you get you won't get confused between the shades and also these retail for 650 rupees in india for which you get around around 12 ml of product so what i find really interesting about this product is that even though it's called a powder puff lippy um they've mentioned it as a powder lip cream so you have powder and you have cream both of which are like completely opposite in terms of formulation and they've thrown both of these together in this um, product and i kind of do agree because it's not exactly a powder formula it's not exactly a cream formula it's kind of like in between like i do not even know how to explain it it's quite similar to the lip creams that nyx already has and it's probably like their best selling lip product but it's also kind of not like the lip cream it's a little more it's just like in between it has a very velvety finish to it and the color that i have like i said is called cool intentions i'm going to quickly show in the swatch and then we will talk about the um wear time of this little more so go watch the swatch and then come back you know that this is what cool intentions looks on my lips even though it looks like i probably just applied a clear lip balm but this is the closest that i will personally get to a shade that is my lips with better because this is exactly what the shade of my lips are however i do uh, wish that this were a little bit darker like a tad bit darker like it is on the packaging because if you compare the color of the packaging to my lips they look slightly different right however do keep in mind that all of us have our own pigmented lips and it really depends on the pigment of your lips on how this will turn out so even though this might turn out like this on me this could turn out darker or lighter on your lips depending on how pigmented your lips are so um now that that is out of the way let's talk about the whole um powder lip cream formulation so i actually do like it the flip side is that because it's a cream formula of course it will transfer and it will fade away in probably like two hours maybe so it's not very long lasting um however i do not have a problem with it actually even though i know that i keep on saying that i love matte lipsticks but i think at this time of the year when it's actually fall slash winter and our lips are gonna get really dry and chapped and beg us for lip balm i think a product like this which is really moisturizing and um pigmented tinted slashed pigmented whatever you want to call it is really appropriate for this time of the year 
basically cooling tensions and squat goals may not show up that well on some of these skin tones because they are kind of like the nudes in the category in this range however you do have dark shades you have reds and you have really cool vampy i think there's like a really cool vampy maroon shade or like a purple shade that is like so fall appropriate so you can get those shades if you want or you can even get these shades there is no harm in getting this shade if you want a shade that is like really natural and makes you look like you've not applied makeup even though you have that whole oh i have not done any makeup no makeup makeup look if you want those sort of looks cool intentions and squad goals may just be um your taste in my opinion i really do like this product and i actually will recommend this product to you however the only question slash doubt that i have is i don't know how different these are from the nyx lip soft matte creams like i know that those are matte and these are not but apart from that one slight difference i don't know how different these are and considering that you get a lot more shades in the soft matte lip range and they are actually cheaper than the um, powder puff lippies i'm not exactly sure if i would ever pick this over that but in itself this is a really good product and you should try it out Overall, I think this is a good product to try. It's coming from a good brand and it is um, a decent product. So do give it a try if you want. And that also brings me to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any video requests for me, leave them in the comment section below. And I will see you guys next time. Till then, take care and I love you all so much. Bye.